And the fight against skin cancer has gone to a whole new level with a revolutionary full body scanner. There's just three of these machines in the country that are being used for research purposes with high risk patients. And I was fortunate enough to treat my skin and my health to a road test of one of them. So Joe, please uh, come in. And uh, Joe, if you wouldn't mind then to get rid of your, yeah, just to put it here mm -hmm. and then uh, walk in here and uh, please stand accordingly, so use these footprints. Mm -hmm. And in regard to your hands, if you just do it like, yes, like this, like, yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. Peter, how much of a game changer is this machine? To be honest, I think this is a significant game changer because as you have seen, you walk in and your total body is, is imaged and this will allow us to really detect your melanoma a potential melanoma much, much earlier. With this frame, we have 92 cameras, 92 Canon cameras, which are basically shooting all within a second. And the image to be built up, this 3D avatar of your body, this takes uh, about 13 minutes. But then we have basically your whole body with all the body surface, and we can then zoom in and have a very great uh, view of, of all your moles and all your blemishes and all your skin lesions. <laughs> that is very confronting. <laughs> Let's go to your upper arm. You know, what we call the outer aspect of your upper arm, and mm -hmm. we see that you have here a, a few moles, which is actually quite typical that um, on this body side, women have quite a few moles. Having said this, all your moles are absolutely fine. Mm. And then, of course, we can also turn you around. And uh, <laughs> wait a moment, I, I show it to you like, like this. Great. This. Currently, it's being used in research and with high-risk patients. How long do you think before it will be readily available to the wider public? Yeah, I think this is a very good question. With this new grant from the Australian Cancer Research Foundation, we will very soon have 15 machines across the eastern seaport and probably more in, in the years to come. And we are starting a so-called melanoma cohort study where we want to recruit high-risk people, but also people with medium risk and low risk people. And we want to, to basically do the world's first and largest study for the detection of, of melanoma. You will also see now that you, we see that you don't have too many moles on your inner side of the upper arms. And you see the, how this is related to, to, the, uh, to the pigmentation and to, to oh, the yeah. sun damage. Yeah. And, and so we can obviously look through your whole uh, body and, uh, and make an assessment of your moles. But you can imagine this would be work also very good with rashes or with other skin conditions. Yes, yes. Peter, you've been working in the field of skin cancer for decades. Yeah. Are we winning the battle against skin cancer here in Australia? Yes, Australia is really, I, I, I like to see it like this, Australia is the best place to doing research in this field. It's no doubt that Australia is leading the world in primary prevention of melanoma, there's no play policy and quite a few others. But generally also now in the last years with the immunotherapy of melanoma, we are starting to win the battle against melanoma. Not every battle, but it's, it's getting very, very close to it. And so there's really a good time now to also work, in, increase the work in the early, in the early detection. Yeah. So uh, you didn't see anything of concern no, there? No, I'm, you are very skin healthy. Congratulations. This is good to know. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yes.